Well, good morning, family. Thank you for joining us on our very last day here in Ireland and Dublin specifically. Today, we don't have much on our agenda. We're just gonna walk around, get some tasty things to eat, and we are going to head out um, to the lighthouse that's here. It's called Pullbeg Lighthouse, I believe. It's about four miles uh, one way from our hotel. So we'll show you the sights and sounds along the way, and then we will bid you adieu, friends. All right, we're about a mile into this walk. We're in Ringsend Park, <clears throat> which is a beautiful little green space. Got a ton of trees. Um, some of those trees have little fairy houses on it, which is very, very cute and uh, traditional, obviously, with the, the folklore of the island, but a uh, really beautiful, quiet little space uh, as we make our way to the docks. Okay, well, this is certainly a walk to remember. If you're walking through like all of the dock working areas and it's very, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? <laughs> oh my God, if we don't make it back, this is where it ends, friends. Okay, good news, we're still alive. Bad news, we still have about two miles to go. So stay with us. We go through all the industrial areas here. You go through the dumps and the docks and all sorts of stuff. But looks like we're about to come out on the other side in a more green, into more green spaces. So I'll show you all of that as we make our way to the lighthouse. Whew, here we go. Okay, 2.77 miles into our walk, we hit Irish Town Nature Park, which overlooks this beautiful portion of the bay here. Very peaceful, very quiet over here. Absolutely beautiful little spot. All right, we've made it to the very serene Poolbeg Strand. It's just covered in shells from razor clams to all sorts of other types of clams that I have no idea what they are, but just absolutely peaceful. You can see a couple of lighthouses out here, which is where we're headed next. <clears throat> but just a beautiful spot that has very little people. I'm not saying something in Dublin. Well, we made it to the end, 4.6 miles to this beauty. You can see it behind me here. Absolutely stunning views as well. Of the Dublin Bay, oh, well worth the walk. Thanks for joining us. All right, 9.3 miles in the books. We stopped at the Ferryman's for a pint. Cheers, love. Cheers. Ah, so damn good. Okay, 
All right, we are saddling up for our final meal at Paulie's Pizza. Let's go in and have us a look. Cheers. Okay, our last meal has arrived. We got the Caprice Pizza. We got a nice looking salad. We're gonna show you this and then we're gonna get at it. Are you ready? I'm so ready. Okay, we'll see you on the other side. Very gorgeous, you're up. You got this. Here it is. The walk. If only you knew. Oh man. First floor is not the floor where you go pee. Uh oh. No, first floor is a different floor. I ended up going all the way negative to the Vitae Club, which is the workout space, which nobody's in there right now. So everything was pitch black dark when I got in there through the elevators. So I was like, hello? And then I go through Club Vitae, and then there's like this spa room. Nobody's in there except for me. So I'm like trying to exit. And then the door on the right was locked, but the door on the left was open. So I like push the door right open. I'm like, Oh my god, and I go to the next one. <sighs> Finally get to where the elevators are at. I realize I need to go up the floor and then another up the floor to go pee. And I pee my pants. Just kidding. <laughs> Oh my god, the adventures when you have a tiny, tiny bladder. <laughs> All right, fam, that wraps up our amazing week here in Ireland. Today, what was your favorite part? Favorite part was the Cliffs of Moher, for sure. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That was incredible, incredible. The Dueling Cave was amazing. The distillery, the Guinness experience, as well as the lighthouse that we walked to uh, earlier today. Absolutely incredible, just a beautiful place food is fantastic and um, the whole experience has been absolutely incredible so hopefully you've loved our videos uh, if you don't follow us on Instagram highly recommend that there's a lot of pictures that we've shared there that aren't covered in the videos from like food we've eaten etc so please check that out at somewhere local at somewhere local yeah and then don't forget to like and subscribe and tell all of your friends and all that good stuff because we're such a lively, <laughs> such a lively um, couple. Anyway, hope you've enjoyed it. We've enjoyed delivering the content to you and just want to say thank you guys for everything you do for us. We love you and we will see you soon. Bye. Bye. Bye.